Welcome to the Windows and Computer and Technology channel and um, just wanted to talk a little bit about Windows Update. Uh, a lot of you have been asking me, you know, why isn't Microsoft giving us more details of Windows Updates within the system itself? And it's a very good question actually. Because when you update your system, you don't have much information on what's in the updates. Um, and it could be a little more um, obvious here. So, you know, one of the things that I always say is you got to understand the wording behind the security updates and the updates in general. So some people have the impression, for example, that, you know, when it says preview, it's not a real update. It is. The preview updates are always bug fixes and they are called preview. Now, you know, it's the wording Microsoft uses and of course it's always, you know, subject to speculation because they're never clear about anything. In general, what you'll have is preview updates, which are bug fixes. You'll have the section on quality updates, which in general is almost always patch Tuesday security updates, but um, you know, it's not always the case, but most of the time. They've got another wording, which is feature updates. So here you see how when I went to 20H2 and 21H1 and then Windows 11. So it tells you what I did as feature updates. Uh, Windows 11 is a lot more detailed in that manner, where Windows 10 has a little less information. But the wording stays the same. In Windows 10, preview updates are bug fixes, and you'll have the quality updates, which are, which are the security updates in general. Then you'll have, of course, other updates, and other updates are Windows Malicious Software Removal Tool or any cumulative update that is a preview for bug fixes within Windows. These will show up also in the other updates. So you can categorize updates as feature updates, which are big new Windows versions if you want. Quality updates, which are usually uh, security fixes or very important bug fixes. And then other updates, which are the malicious updates and the bug fixing updates that you might have installed. So they're all separated in those ways. And then there's of course driver updates and all sorts of things like that. So they usually have a KB number next to it. And when you have an update, uh, the best way to have more information about what is that, what's in there, is to click the Learn More button. The Learn More button will always bring you to a page, a Microsoft page, and it will highlight what they fixed and what they've changed in uh, a update. And for security updates, you'll be, of course, sent to the security updates and what they actually have uh, fixed in security updates and the important updates. So there's always, um, you know, a mix of information. It's not in the Windows update itself, but if you click the learn more button, it brings you to a, a blog page for Microsoft and it will actually have explained to you what these updates are all about. But yep, Microsoft could of course be a little clearer when it actually issues the updates um, in general and you know have um, better understanding and knowledge of when it's a bug fixing update that you might not need or it's a security update which is super important but in general without having out of cycle updates the security updates are on the second tuesday of the month if you enjoy my videos please subscribe give us thumbs up thank you for watching